Hey, hey, welcome back, everybody. We've hit Luigi's engine room. And this is when the computers start to get hard, because I put them on hard. Uh, my brother did say I should have started with them on hard, and I guess I kind of agree now that I think about it. But we're here. We're now reaching the hard point. And I did play a game in my spare time. So this should be the last match I need to play before... Um, okay. Uh, before uh, we unlock Bowser's Magma Mountain. Oh, shit, wait, DK also beat me out? Wait a minute, I didn't see that. Oh, yeah, speaking of our CPUs, yeah, these are our crew. We got Luigi, we got Peach, and we got DK. Obviously, Luigi needs to be here. So, here we are. This is probably one of one of my favorite maps next to uh, Mario's Rainbow Castle because of how unique it is and great music and great visual looks. But um, it's also a very frustrating map because every turn, the door, red and blue doors alternate making it really hard to traverse the map normally. Um, so yeah, and two, at least two stars require you to visit Bowser. So yeah, it's gonna be a bit of a pain in the ass of the map. We could, I almost thought I would've lost the last one, but you never know, we could lose this one. Also, we all got it too, except for Luigi, who just plowed through with a 10. Good job, Luigi. You've proven yourself to be dangerous. No chicken left. I have to hope I can finish this game within an hour. So we make it, we have to be quick. I got, I've been so busy today. At the time of recording this, it is a Wednesday. Um, I had to go out with my mom to get my, to do Christmas shopping. I had to record the Mario Kart 8 DLC video, which definitely went up on the Wednesday. So go and check that out. It was hilarious. I didn't even win that. Um, I, I couldn't even record right away because, um, well, I'm not going to say why because it's not my business. And I wanted to play the uh, Mario Kart 8 DLC with my brother at least once and that was an absolute chaotic mess and it was the best kind of a chaotic mess. On the very last course, the very last section, or la almost the last lap, we were playing 3DS's Rainbow Road. Oops. Um, I got bombarded by two blue shells and a chain chomp, all before I can even start moving again. And my brother ended up winning that race because of that. And he won the whole thing. It was absolutely hilarious. I'm not gonna make it to the door so I'm gonna stall myself out. Maybe I can get a low number here. I don't really know why, because again, I'm not in really any position to be visiting Bowser. But we'll see, we'll see how this goes. I, I do have to do a little bit better now because the computers are not going to give me any leeway. Ugh. Bulls. Get the monkey! Oh, they're all coming for me. Okay then. Well, that's fine, I guess. If that's the way the game wants to play it. Don't let monkey win. Peach. Play better. They're on hard up until they're faced with each other, and then they're absolute morons. Dumb shits. Oh, come on, Peach. Get him. Get him. You... Come on. You guys are so terrible at this. You know what, actually? I don't know why I'm encouraging one of them to win. I would rather see a draw, so that way nobody gets money. Especially if not, it's not going to be end monkey one. Alrighty. So, Donkey Kong, I see you want to be the minigame problem. Stupid ape. I needed those ten coins. Now I need to really hope for a low number. Alrighty. Oh, he's already getting money. No shot, you idiot. You can't even make it. All right, well, I mean, that open, that <laughs> realistically, literally opens the door for me, but I still can't get a big enough number because I can't afford it. I need anything low, five or lower. I hate this game. <laughs> to hell with this! Not only did they decide, nah, you can have a big number, we're also going to take your money from you. I asked for this. I put those- I put that dumb dice block on. 
I pay. I'm paying for this. Oh my goodness. This is not boding well either for the fact that I need to collect a lot of money just to, you know, afford the map. Otherwise, I will have to take a break and play games until I can afford it. I have a feeling that this is not going to be a game that sees um, a consistent upload after um, I beat all the boards. Because I don't really know how I'm going to get uh, 100 stars within the next two weeks of playing this game. Okay, okay, come on, come on. Fast movement, Yoshi, fast movement. Move, 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 move! Get that first minigame win! Yes! Give me that! Give me that message that says Yoshi wins. He's my boy, my lad! I'm still in last by three coins, but who cares? Yoshi won! I love Yoshi! He's my man! Also, nobody can afford the star now, which is fine, except for me. Oh wait, no, not even Luigi, because he's gonna lose three coins from lighting on that red space. Good. You can't afford it. Good, now go visit Bowser too. I don't know why that idiot monkey decided to spend his 20 coins on opening the doors, but... Oh, now I have to hit the red space too. Okay, well, the important thing is, so long as I'm not in first... Which I could very well be after this minigame. Uh, Luigi won't steal from me. But I guess... Oh, wait a minute. This could be good. This could be good. Alright, now Peach can steal from Donkey Kong. And then if Peach has enough coins, Luigi will steal from her. And then I can steal from whoever's in first. It's a genius plan that in no doubt is going to go horribly wrong. Oh, actually, no, this is good. Because even if I... Mm, we're looking at a good, looking at a good turn. Can we be looking good? Oh, wait a minute, no, because now it's a 2v2, and me and Luigi are gonna steal the money, and... Yeah, see, I told you, something's gonna go wrong. Oh, that's a, actually, that's assuming we win. Hmm, I would rather not lose. Also, I'm decked out with my green Joy-Con now, because I, I used some contact cleaner to clean my Joy-Cons, and now my green one actually kind of works much better. So now I can use my purple and green and go full sense stylish because these are like my favorite color Joy-Cons. Barring my blue one, I like my blue one, but... I, li I, don't, I, I, I like to I like to just stray away from default. So I have green and purple. I got the, uh, the Iggy Koopa set up, if you, want, if you want to say that. I think of it differently, but I also remember like in Mario Kart, it, the Iggy's Kart colors are light green and purple. And it's like a really nice color combination. But one of the characters of my own named Katie, she has the colors of green and purple as well. And I'm like, you know what? It's just a stylish cart combination, or color combination. I don't know why I said cart combination there. Ooh! That's not good. They could have caught up there. Luigi! We almost screwed that up, you dumbass. It's alright though, we still won. We didn't beat the record, but we almost did. Okay, so, wait, uh... Ah, oh, yeah, now he's gonna steal from me. God damn! I don't like. Oh well, I'll just steal from him back. Yeah, okay, fine. We'll play trade. You take some coins from me. And I hopefully take some coins from you. Hopefully enough to at least get me back to where I was. Oh, now he's getting that. I'm nuts, Luigi. Hey, you, you suck. Also, love how the board kind of goes right. Uh. Damn it! Now, why couldn't that have been me? Baby, that's big. All right, Luigi. All is fair. Give me, but give me, give me some of my coins back. Yeah. Okay. Fine. I didn't get all of my coins back, but I'm still gonna get three more from landing on a blue space, or maybe even an item in the space. Oh yeah. I hate to. Do that. I need to cut down on episode time because I'm gonna rush here, but I could never resist a one player mini game space, especially considering I could win this, get more money, and then screw Luigi for taking my coins. All right, let's limbo. I hate. I hated this minigame as a kid, and to be frankly honest, I still do. 
At least they give you the notification when you're probably going to fall. Alright, come on, Yoshi. Oh, nice and short, too. Look at that. 15 seconds. And get that free money. Give me my coins, baby. Give me my money. Oh, now I'm tied with Luigi. Okay, I can take that. It's not gonna last very long because someone's gonna someone's gonna steal some of our coins. I'm just hoping that by the time DK reaches the star or boom, Luigi's in first place. I really shouldn't be encouraging the idea that CPUs are beating me, but when it comes to boo, I kind of need to make those kinds of exceptions. Running of the bulb. Oh, now we're all now we're a team. Yeah, remember those guys, your opponents. You kind of want to hit one of them for stealing that well-earned star of yours. Those three, that guy's now your teammate. But I'm the one holding the light bulb. Everyone, protect me! Gosh. Ah, oh, okay. I have, I had a really, really mix between cool and terrifying dream a few nights ago. And I have not been able to get it out of my head, and this doesn't help. I had a dream where the entire world was brainwashed, and I was the- my character- I guess it was told in the uh, context of my characters instead, but my character was the only one left. And now, the morbid, curious side of my brain took that idea- took that dream and made, made a plot out of it. And, like, I'm not gonna lie, the crap I thought up of almost scared me, and it really still does. To be fully honest, I don't know if I mentioned this on, on this channel or not, but one of my biggest fears in fiction, like the way fiction uses it, is mind control and brainwashing. And it terrifies me how that shit is used in, in media. Like, I know a, a lot of it is also like hypnosis is kind of disguised in there too, but the reality is that that is not entirely accurate. Uh, hypnosis is kind of misconceptuated or misportrayed in media where it's not it's a sleep technique but like straight up mind control is just terrifying like it scares me it genuinely scares me how it's used in media and that m idiotically morbid curious side of me often defaults to just constantly thinking about it because i don't know what it is but my brain tends to think a lot about my fears so yeah, having a dream like that, where the entire world is turned against you. If you ever thought a zombie apocalypse was scary, think about it that way. If you're the only person left, everyone's alive, but no one has any free will. They're all just puppets. That's terrifying. That's, I think, scarier than a zombie apocalypse. So yeah, enjoy enjoy a little bit of um, me opening up to my audience, even though I doubt there's many people watching this. Yeah, but no, like, the running of the bulb minigame just kind of reminded me of that again. Because it's like your entire team, all, like everyone's supposed to be a team, but your teammates could be turned against you for a while. So it it's genuinely scary for me. Oh gosh, what happened? And yeah, it was hard to get the, it's been hard to get that out of my mind for the past few days. And honestly, it's still on my mind. I I even went as far as to literally write down this plot on my computer because I was like, again, that morbid curious sense of me wanted to do it and get it. First off, I think my brain wouldn't let me get away with forgetting this. So I did it and geez, who knows what I'll make out of that if I do, if I do, but... I don't know. I don't know how I managed to actually follow through with writing all of that despite literally telling myself, you are terrifying yourself out of this. Like, what the hell are you doing, man? Why are you such a dumbass? I sure, I, I, I hope that, that, that you liked all that exposition. I honestly don't even know how to follow up with all that. I tend to pour a lot of myself out when, at times like these, when I'm just trying to talk. Uh, and then suddenly I just have verbal diarrhea and I'm, sp I'm spilling out all sorts of things. And I don't stop. I talk a lot, but then I also don't talk enough. It's a bit- it's a weird mix. What are you- 
Oh, right. Wait, I'm not even in first! Luigi has just as many coins. Go rob from him, you dumb monkey. You stupid ape! Yoshi, we need to do something. Also, Peach has got a lot of money, too. I absolutely love the Yoshi noises Yoshi makes. Mostly, I like modern Yoshi noises. They're adorable. As opposed to Toad, where my love for Toad stems from his uh, N64 visual design and voice. Yoshi, I think a lot of what a lot of my love for Yoshi, I love his N64 design. I personally like the red boots over the um, the brown ones he's been he wears in most modern appearances, if not all modern appearances, but. Yoshi's regular voice. Whoa. I love it. Also, obviously, Yoshi in general is just an adorable character. Yoshi's story is to thank for my love for Yoshi, and I will gladly play that game again and again. Uh, come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Come on! Damn it! I was mashing that button! You all saw it! You all saw how close I was! I could have had that! I should have had that! Damn monkey! Who let that guy out of the zoo? Also, good. Lose some coins, Luigi. You're gonna steal from me anyway, but... Oh yeah, technically all things considered, because Luigi gained one coin here, then loses 20. Um, he technically only loses 19 coins. Oh, but he can still afford the star! No, that's not good! I need that! I need that! I need this dub! I haven't lost yet! Unless people want to see me lose. But I'm not gonna try for that. You have to see me lose because I actually got screwed over. Aw, oh, damn it. I was hoping it would be above where I am. I don't think anyone's really close by to that, are they? Peach is all the way at the top of the map. These two are near the beginning, and I'm about to round about to the beginning as well. I think it's cutting it close, but I really hope... Oh, wait a minute. Now he's just gonna steal from me again. Damn it! I still think the computers are on me. They're on Mew here. I love Mew. I've said that before. I'm not gonna lie, my my bed is like choked full of punches. No regrets. No shame either. Shame is for the weed. Well, mm, no. Because I felt shame before. But screw shame on that. I have a giant green Yoshi that's actually my brother's. I just keep it on my bed. I have like every other color Yoshi in that imagine what type of maybe four now. I have like so many Pokemon. I got King DDD was a chunky fuck. The best kind. Oh, blessed! I get another one-player minigame. Too bad it's boring and sucks, but I could still do that. I could still work with this. I just need to make sure my timing is good. And I can get the maximum amount of coins out of this. I hate slot machines, though. As anyone should. Randomized gambling. Except this one doesn't cost me anything. It will if I lose. Alright, I gotta focus. Okay, we're going for a coin bag, I guess. There we go. I'll take it. It's better than losing. I'll take getting five coins. Um, yeah, the Mario cap is the one you want to go for, and you get a nice 20 coins from that. So, that would have been nice, but you know what? You gotta take what you can get, you know? And honestly, that's better than getting a one coin or losing, because if you lose, you lose five coins. Peach, I hope you stay there. Grab bag! Let's do it! Let's go! They're on hard though, so this might be a little bit trickier. But let's go! We gotta make some money! We gotta... Who's got the most? Who's got the most money? Peach? Luigi? No, it's definitely gotta be Peach. Or I'll just go for whoever's in front of me. No. No! That wasn't for you. Go away, Louis. You know what? No, 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 no. You need to be dropped. K 
Come here. Everyone's giving me coins. All of your coins are belonging to me. Yes. Make a profit, Yoshi. Not that way. Oh, no. Yeah, one last coin bag for the road. Everybody comes out losers except for me. Let's get it. How much did I rack in? 31. Let's go. This is good. I need this money. Screw all of you. This is what I'm talking about. All right, two more turns. Uh, that's good. And now I need Luigi to get... Okay, also good. Now you guys have a better chance of missing that door. Oh, please don't give me... That's not good. That I just screwed everything up. Unless Peach hits one too. No, she's not because... The... What's gonna happen here? No. That's bad. That's so bad. I ruined everything in the Ukraine game. Alright. Normally, I would literally just sack a CPU, but I'm gonna- I'm going. That's my phone alarm. Sorry about that. That's playing Foresight from Melee. Anyway, normally I would go for the one of the CPUs, but I sincerely do not trust that they won't mash their way out of that. So I'll, I'm gonna be- I'm gonna be boring, play it safe, and grab this treasure chest. Because I need, I need to get guaranteed money. I don't need to get a chance to get money. I don't want to lose. I just want to get coins. So I'll take 10. I probably would have gotten more if I had picked up Peach. But we're not taking that chance. Um, honestly, I wouldn't have gotten that much more. Damn it. Of all people, it's you. In retrospect, I probably should have tried to get Luigi because he was closest to the, um, pipe, but... Again, i thinking more or less of me, less of my overall game. He has three stars, that's totally bad. Maybe if we're lucky, Peach will be smart and she'll try and steal a star from Luigi if she gets out of there. I'm one sp I missed it! No, you know what? I will take care of this. I will take care of this. Unless we get a really hefty coin collecting mini game, I can't allow you to get a fourth star, Luigi. Yes, I'll take all of it. Thank you. Now he's at zero. I'm willing to do that. You know what? All worth it. I just can't let... Can't let him win. Peach, we're gonna need to pick it up. Princess, if you don't... If you don't... If you don't make this minigame magic, you are going to be... I'm going to hit you. Okay, bomb skip ball. He can't gain anything more than 10 coins from this, meaning Luigi cannot get the next star unless he gets a really small number, which I'm scared that he probably could. Give me that. We cannot allow you to win. Blammo, let's get it! Oh, this is, they, you know what, this game is heated now. I am making it heated. I am turning up the heat in this engine room to dangerous degrees that literally could blow everything up. But don't worry about that. We'll see you guys in the next episode where we finish this game and hopefully I make a comeback. See you then.